ever felt the pressure of a slam Saturday night with a new staff member who's just staring at the POS system? We've all been there. A smooth onboarding process is key to a happy team and a thriving restaurant. So, if you're wondering how to add staff to Touch Bistro and get them up to speed quickly, you've come to the right place. Building the team. Admin access required. Before we dive in, a quick heads up. Adding staff requires admin or manager access in Touch Bistro Cloud. This ensures you have the proper permissions to create user accounts and set access levels. Now, let's get those new hires on board. Step 1. Logging in and choosing your crew location. First things first, fire up your computer and log in to Touch Bistro Cloud. Once you're in, navigate to the staff section. Here, you might see a select a venue option if you manage multiple locations. Just pick the location where your new team member will be working their magic. Step 2. Welcome to the crew. Creating the staff account. Alright, now for the exciting part. Creating the staff account. Click on members, and then the big, friendly add staff button. This is where you'll fill in all the essential details about your new team member. Name, initials, especially helpful for those common last names. All the usual suspects. Pro tip. Don't forget the passcode. Here's a crucial step. Setting the staff passcode. This four-digit code, minimum, is their key to clocking in and out and for some payment integrations in Touch Bistro. Make it something secure but memorable for them. Step three, assigning roles, the superpower of staff types. Now let's talk about staff types. Think of them as superpowers for your team. Touch Bistro allows you to assign different permission levels based on staff roles. Will they be a server, a bartender, or maybe a manager with full access? Choosing the appropriate staff type ensures they can do their jobs effectively without compromising security. Step 4. Table talk, color coordination for smooth service. This might seem like a small detail, but trust us, it makes a difference. You can assign a specific color to each staff member in Touch Bistro. This way, when they take tables, it's easy to see on the floor plan who's serving which area. It might sound simple, but it helps streamline communication and service during busy rushes. Step 5. QR code power up, optional but handy. Touch Bistro offers an optional feature, generating QR codes for staff members. While not essential for initial setup, these QR codes can be scanned later to access staff accounts directly on the POS system. Think of it as a handy shortcut, especially for staff who might not be familiar with usernames and passwords. Security matters. A few extra tips. Before we wrap it up, let's talk about some best practices for staff onboarding in Touch Bistro. Unique passcodes. We mentioned it before, but it's worth repeating. Encourage unique passcodes for each staff member. This is a basic security measure to protect your system. Limited access is key. Assign staff types that reflect their roles. Don't give full admin access to everyone. Training time. Adding a staff member to Touch Bistro is just the first step. Take the time to train them properly on the system and your restaurant's specific procedures. With that said, thanks for watching. Until next time, happy staffing and happy business.